wasn't good enough from the group. Uh, we gave up three goals at home, and that's just not acceptable if we want to win the game. Um, we put two away, and that's enough, especially in our home atmosphere, to get the result. And it's a lot of games, and it's not an excuse. We steered away from uh, our game plan and our game model. We we're a little undisciplined, so it'll be good to get these, you know, this little break, so we can refocus. Hi, Danny. Um, it looks like there was a shift in multiple times in the positioning in midfield. Sometimes a double pivot, sometimes the single. You obviously played in both the single and the double. What do you see the differences in those positions and what is asked of you? Yeah, I mean, uh, the game changes. You know, sometimes they come out in a different way that we didn't anticipate. So it's kind of just, uh, you know, in the single, you have to cover a little more ground. Um, the double helped us uh, counterattack a little better. We didn't execute it good enough still, but um, kind of just focusing on what the team needs at that point. Danny, you've got significant minutes over the last couple of matches. Can you talk about what you've been able to take away from having that playing time out there and you know any positives that you see moving forward? Yeah, I mean, for me personally, it's always, I think it's great for any player to get more minutes. Um, you know, it helps with your own confidence um, to get rhythm as well. Um, I know earlier in the season, I wasn't getting as, as much time and that happens. And I was just prepared to, to seize my opportunity and you know, take advantage of the moments that I have. So I'm happy about that. I'm just still very disappointed in the result. Uh, obviously, the team comes first, whether I play or not. And it doesn't matter to me. The success, the success of the team is what's most important. And that's what makes this group special. We all believe that whether it's, you know, there's no hatred towards the other guy in front of you. It's more of we're a family and we want to all do good together, no matter who's on the field. So. You mentioned it before, but... Uh, uh how does it feel to be finally not have to worry about a game midweek, like you like it has been the case like pretty much for last couple of months now? How does it feel to finally be able to get some normal, have a normal preparation? Yeah, I mean it's it's more of a mental break for us. Um, it's, it's a long season and back to back games is hard on the body and mentally, you know. Uh, so it's good for us to to take some time away from it. We can come back into the next week fresh new mindset, go back to our little fundamentals, have time to actually have a full week of training and, and come prepared. So it's uh, that's going to be really big for us. Uh, ahead of the game, Giorgio spoke about uh, one of the things that he felt you guys could add was that, that little bit of quality when you get the ball in space and, and the ability to play the ball forward. Tonight it looked rushed or it, it just wasn't coming off for whatever reason. I guess my question to you is, was it was it rushed? Was it a uh, because the game was out, laid there and you guys were maybe pushing too hard, or is it is it still the legs kind of not there? I think I mean uh, ultimately it's just we weren't clean enough on the ball. You could say the legs, you could say the multiple games, but uh, matter of fact is there was enough time and space for us to play. Um, a lot of the passes that you can see is just unforced errors, and that's on us. Whether it's tired legs or not, it's a five ten yard pass to an open man to the correct foot. Um, and those are things you should do. Um, and we just we weren't good enough in those fundamentals in the entirety of the game. And like I said, it's a time for us to now refresh our minds, go back into the new week, go back to the basics and get it done. And if we want to win games, you know, we're a team that loves to be on the ball. We're a team that wants to counter press, so we need to go back to those things. So us giving away sloppy passes, is, uh, it kills us. Dani, un juego muy difícil, pero eh, es casi imposible eh, rescatar un empate, quizás una victoria, eh, cuando se cometen demasiados errores en la defensa. Y para ti como joven, pues eh, sigues buscando oportunidades, pero ¿qué tan difícil es entrar en estos momentos cuando es una mala racha del equipo? Sí, pero los últimos dos juegos hemos ganado y es el tercer, tercer juego de la semana. Y como dijiste, si nosotros estamos metiendo dos goles en casa, tenemos que ganar. Pero fallamos en, en cosas fácil. Nuestra defensa no hicimos nuestro trabajo hoy día y nos costó.